so much of a focus on rebuilding here in Southwest Florida, downtown Fort Myers is always seeing plenty of building, especially on the eastern edge of that area. And we have reported on the housing situation for years in this region with tight space and of course those high prices. So Fox 4 evening anchor Chris Earl is live from just outside of a major development on the eastern edge of downtown, one that thousands of drivers see every day. And Chris, this is going to add to the supply, but also could be what starts a new stage of development. Good evening, Char. It's definitely the goal here, especially from Fort Myers city leaders. Those words also coming from Fort Myers Mayor Kevin Anderson when I talked to them just a couple of days ago. As a first street apartments, what's going up right now, it is behind us. You can definitely see it. And even right now at this hour, you can still hear some of the crews that are working. And of course, we're on first street. We've got the downtown library just to the right of the screen here. As this building, though, the first street apartments, still about a year from welcoming tenants in, but the progress more than halfway complete. As we take a look now from up top on our Skyfox drone, here are the particulars with this four stories 274 units when it's all done but this was an empty lot for a few years and before that first united methodist church was here but this also comes as downtown fort myers is seeing more attention and more of a focus for tourism after hurricane ian hit as with this location just blocks from the nightlife as well we talked with the mayor who sees the progress every day from his office at city hall and how this could help with the housing supply right here here we happen to have a high demand because of all the people moving here in a low supply. So the, the more we can do to uh, increase that supply, hopefully it will cause the, the pricing for rental units and homes to kind of level off, stabilize more. And just steps from where the First Street apartments are going up, about a block and a half away. The Edison Grand is one of the cornerstones of downtown as the building itself has been up for decades, but still some of the units are available there. And between the two, this is also going up. A new option called the Irving Downtown Apartments, about 100 units, or described as eco-friendly, pet-friendly units. But ground expected to break there in a couple of months with it being already by the end of 2025. So it's still a couple years out. But you might remember last year there were concerns right here on this very block at first and Fowler about Native American artifacts that might also be buried underneath. But a July report to the city concluded that there were no artifacts on the ground, at least west of Fowler, where this does sit. But still ahead at six, we'll also take a more of a tour throughout the downtown area. As the mayor says, this building, the first street apartments, might be only the start towards really revitalizing this part as well a few blocks south of here. Reporting live in downtown Fort Myers, Chris Earl, Fox 4 News. Chris